Holy shit, it's fucking happening. Hello people of the internet, today I Swector bring you incredibly good news. Did we cure cancer? Did we achieve world peace? Did Nickelback resign and f***ing die? No, no, and I f***ing wish, but sadly, no. I was recently sent this tweet by a viewer of mine by the name of Jack MDG. Jack, I just want to give you a quick thank you for sending me this. I know several other people did the same thing, but you snooze, you lose. An insider at Rockstar by the name of Jan2295 recently made a claim on GTA forums that Bully2 is indeed in development and that it will be the next Rockstar game to be released right after Red Dead Redemption 2. While Jan2295 has been right about several previous Rockstar leaks, he has yet to prove any evidence to back up his claim. So while proper evidence is lacking, it's worth bearing in mind that the person making the claim has also been right about several previous other Rockstar related claims. And apparently Jan was also voted most respected in the year of 2016. Would 2016's most respectable GTA forums member lie? Well, I think not. But, you know, you'd be the judge, I guess. Now, some of you might be going, hey, proof, you know, that kind of helps the credibility along the way, you know? And understandably so, because there really is no proof. The only thing we have to go by is a really, really good track record. It's not flawless, but he's been right about several things as of late. And really, what would his incentive be to lie at this point? I mean, he's one of the most respectable, if not the most respected user on GTA forums. And he's been consistently providing us with leaks and information. As Suziak, a Twitter user, requested proof, he received pretty much the only available answer at this time, which would be, Yon2295 is the best leaker in the GTA community. Well, there you have it. Thanks, Axel. Yon2295 would go on to make the claim yet again, this time on Twitter, stating, As I said on GTA forums yesterday, Bully 2 is in development and is supposed to be the next Rockstar game after Red Dead Redemption 2. In a recent article entitled, Bully by Rockstar Games is in development, according to online leaks, holy sh**. That's a mouthful. You know, the point of having a title is to, like, summarize it and give the reader, like, a hint or like an inkling of what's going on. The title is not there just to like tell you the entire content of the article. In a recent article entitled Bully 2 by Rockstar Games is in development according to online leaks written by Zaid Saifi, we get a quick breakdown of this supposed leak. Coincidentally, this is also one of the worst and most lazily written news articles I've ever read in my entire life. So if you're like, I like it when Swag gets annoyed and bitches about stuff, then you're gonna have a good old time. If not, then... Uh... It is no secret that Rockstar is developing Dead Red Redemption 2, and that the game is expected to make its debut somewhere in Q3 this year. Just like how it is in the original Red Dead Redemption game, fans are expecting a massive landmass, as well as in-game features in Red Dead Redemption 2. First off, let's just dissect that wording. Fans are expecting a massive landmass as well as in-game features. Well, no fucking shit. It's an open world game set in the Wild West, isn't it? <laughs> like, what the f could you expect from it? Like, oh, you know, exploring this massive land, you know, and, and enjoying these game mechanics. Yeah, that's, you know, kind of fun on the side, but what I really come for is the soundtrack. Like, who the f on what planet? On what planet do you have people waiting enthusiastically for a game only to just be like, oh, it has features? Cool. I think the fact that it has game mechanics and in-game features is what f***ing qualifies it as a video game in the first place. Pedantic rant aside, let's proceed. Rockstar had just launched Bully Anniversary Edition for mobile may serve as a sign that they are working on Bully 2. I think what the person writing this article is trying to communicate here is that Rockstar recently released Bully Anniversary Edition for mobile devices as a method of generating hype for Bully 2, if it really is in the making. The article then shows us the aforementioned tweet that Jan2295 made wherein he pretty much just says that yes, Bully 2 is in the making. The sequel to Bully is also one of the most sought games from Rockstar right now, and having it around can further boost Rockstar's dominance in the gaming industry. Well, yeah, 
Duh, I'm, I'm sorry, but any person who is even the slightest bit familiar with Rockstar's catalog of games ought to know by now that while Bully wasn't a financial hit, at least in contrast to the success of GTA San Andreas, it definitely left a demand for a sequel. I mean, this is all just filler. People are excited for this game they've been waiting for. It's like, yeah, no shit. The sequel is in development, is being confirmed by one of the most trusted sources. And then they proceed to spell his name wrong. You know, it's a name consisting of three letters followed by four numbers. It's not that difficult to spell his name. You could actually go to his Twitter handle and just verify, like, is it Y-A-N or Y-A? And it's a huge inconsistency because in the middle of this article, you have a Twitter screen cap plastered, which actually shows his username. And then if you check the actual tags of this article, they f***ing spell it correctly, so like the one time they actually refer to his name, it's like, oh, oops, sorry, boss. Hey, Zaid. You know, there's this thing called English class in Bully. You should probably check it out. And if you do, make sure to spell sh** as many times as you can, because it's f***ing hilarious. John2295 would later go on to confirm that Rockstar North is the team currently working on Bully 2, and that they have been for at least a few months now. In other Bully 2 related news, it recently came to light that an actor by the name of Roger Grunwald was recently involved with the production of a game by Take 2, Rockstar Games to be more specific. Apparently Mr. Grunwald portrayed or is portraying a German psychiatrist. Which could mean that a German psychiatrist might just make an appearance in Bully 2. Jimmy, what is your relationship with your father like? I sincerely hope that this is true, because if it is, then it would mean that the very first Bully 2 character ever to be revealed would be a six foot tall German shrink. Because, you know, that's the type of cat that you'd expect in a game about school mischief and gang rivalry. <laughs> Right? I hope his name is Blitz. I want his name to be Blitz. I was only following orders. And just in case there are any German viewers out there who are like, does what the f or whatever, let me assure you that Germany and I are a okay. I've listened to plenty of Rammstein throughout my life, which I feel basically extinguishes any kind of incendiary remark I could have made about Germany. You know, you and me, Germans, we're fucking tight. You know, it's, it's like a couple of haagen -Dazs, you know? While I do think that there could be something to this, I will probably remain neutral on this until we either get a comment from Rockstar about this, or Jan2295 backs up his claim. Judging from his past record in GTA Online update speculation and leaks, there is some credibility to be taken into account. I actually attempted to contact Jan2295 for further details, but sadly he appears to be limited in what he can reveal. And like I said, while I do think that it's a good thing to take these sort of claims with a grain of salt, I definitely lend more credibility to someone who's clearly respected and an honest member in the GTA fanbase, as opposed to some clickbait news site making absurd claims and then covering their ass by claiming that their articles are satire. Like satire of fucking what? An honest news source? We claim that something was true when in reality it wasn't true at all. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's a real knee slapper right there, classic. <laughs> f*** you, alright, just f*** you. What do you guys think? Do you think that there's any credibility to this claim? And if so, why? Do you think that Yon2295 is telling the truth and that Bully2 really is in the making? Or do you feel otherwise? Share your thoughts and speculations in the comment section below. If you enjoy speedruns, machinimas, beta analysis videos, or just news regarding Bully2, I'm your fucking dude. You know, I got you covered. The moment anything happens, I'm just, just like on that sh**, you know? I actually have a beta analysis video in the making, which should be up this Friday at 8pm, Central European Summertime, as always. Before I end this video, I'd just like to take a moment to urge you guys to check out and follow me on Twitter. I post pretty frequently on there, and it's a very good communicative medium for me and my audience members. So if you feel like connecting to me and see if we have anything in common, then you could reach me on Twitter at Swegta. And while you're at it, you might as well follow Jan2295 for any possible further details on his Bully 2 claim. I know I will. That's it for me. Thank you guys for watching. Hey folks, have an awesome day. Peace.